the new Freddy Funko Halloween NFT Funko Pops are lit. And I say they're lit because it looks like they all glow in the dark. Why did you just boot my nose? What do you think of that? That's fine. I'm pretty excited about this Series 3 Freddy Funko Halloween set. It's not a Series 3, it's Series 1. This is Funko Ween, not Halloween. Holy f it is. How did I not realize it was Funko? Why the f did they change it? I don't know, but can I like answer your first question? How did I not realize that is what you said, I think? Because you're f***ing stupid. You're stupid. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. I knew it was Funko Ween. I saw the picture once. So the new Funko Ween Funko Pops look fantastic, and they are lit. I'm saying it again because I believe at least three of these are glow in the dark. They had a photo of the samurai that looked like it glows in the dark. Then they had a glow in the dark pirate picture as well. I've seen that, and I think whatever that thing is. In the very back, directly behind the pirate. It, you mean the ninja is what people are speculating? It's a ninja? That's what people are saying. It could be. I don't know. Why does he have a helmet? The, the, he has a helmet, right? Yeah, well, it's some sort of, maybe it's a samurai sword. I don't know. No, because there's a is samurai Is that the Naruto right hat thing that they wear? Naruto headband? Naruto? No, Naruto? but what's around his head? There's black around his head. I don't think I don't think that I honestly is thought it was ninja. a race car driver. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I don't think it's a no, race car No, look, on the corner it has a throwing star on the side of his head. Oh, well, what's he have on his head then? I don't know. Like I said, it's like a Naruto headband thing. I don't know. I don't know. Both I don't stupid. know ninjas. Do I look like a ninja guy? You know about Ninja Turtles. Did you see the Proto the Dog Zombie where it's holding it, I think, like its own arm maybe? Yeah, I can't tell. I don't know. Like, that's fine. And you know its crown and eyes are going to glow in the dark. That thing's f***ing awesome looking. Did you see the Freddy Funko? It looks like a knight. He has like a shield and a, and a sword. <gasps> um, don't care. That was a real yawn, but it came at the perfect time because I don't fucking This care. thing is badass, and it reminds me of Kurgan from Highlander. You ever What's see Highlander? Highlander? Highlander is a classic, and if you don't know what it is, then it's your loss. Well, I don't. Then it looks like there's a cowboy. I don't know if it's a cowboy. I don't know what it is. I think it is. It is. Well, think what's it, what's that gold thing next to it? It looks like a leg. See, I don't know. It doesn't look like a leg. Right, doesn't it? It looks like a scythe or something. It does look like a scythe. I don't know. I don't. I don't know I'm what that so is. I'm so confused. I like all of this, though. This is amazing. This might be the best thing that Funko has ever done. Okay, so do you want to know? Ever. Yeah, we know. Ever. Do you want to know my opinion on it? No, I don't, actually, because I, I feel like you're going to ruin it for me, and I'm just enjoying myself. I'm and not I think trying they're fantastic. to ruin it for you're, you. You're, they're so lame and stupid. Don't you always all over Harry Potter and that's like one of my favorite things in the whole world. Harry Potter is legitimately dumb and everybody knows that. It's very stupid. No, it isn't. It's made for stupid people. That's why they made Harry Potter. Don't you remember the, have you ever read the, the book about that? The doc, you ever watched the documentary? Where they talk about how they made the film for dumb people? You're okay. telling me you never read that or heard of it or watched the movie. Is that what you're saying? The audiobook? What are you talking about? They made a film slash book slash audio book slash something else where they made Harry Potter for dumb people. That's the whole reason why it was made. No, I had no idea. You didn't know that? They made it for children, first of all. Exactly, dumb people. Children are not dumb. They're not, they're not that smart yet. They haven't gotten to my level yet. Did I ever tell you that I was always in like very, 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 very high level classes. No, you weren't. Yes, I was. They used to give me extra work because I just sat there bored because I just zoomed through all my all my stuff. Coloring books don't count, Heather. So what do you have to say about this? You're gonna ruin my dreams. You're gonna make me upset. Go ahead. What are you gonna say? Honestly, I was really excited to see that they were doing a Halloween drop. Yeah. But then seeing all of the redeemables, they look cool, but they're not for me. Like I really, really like the pirate and that that's the only one that I like, ba just based on the cards. You only like the pi Oh my god, the pirate's standing on a treasure chest! Yes. I didn't even notice that. He's got some booty. That's the only one you like out of all? He's got a zombie dog. When have they ever made a zombie listen, dog? Listen. Tell I'm, me that. Listen, I need to see the actual redeemables before I make a real decision, but like, they just don't speak to me. Like, I like the zombie thing, but like, one oh being a possible ninja race car driver, I don't care about that. The ninja cowboy a race car driver, he has a throwing star in his head. Okay, and he has a helmet on. It's a ninja helmet, Heather. I don't think ninjas wear helmets. Yes, they do. They do a lot of flips. There's a 
very high probability of hitting her head and hurting himself. I also don't really care about the samurai guy. Oh, like, come on. I think he looks cool, but he has a glow dark sword. I I understand what you're saying. I don't. I just look. Okay. Look at him with his sword glowing in the dark. Chris, and he has a glow in the dark face. That's fine. But his nose looks like a heart upside down. I was going to say a butt. And I prefer it if it were a butt, not a heart. This might be the coolest thing that Funko has ever done. Oh my God. I didn't even notice on the other photo that Proto has a little like medallion around his neck. For his, like, his little tag. It glows in the dark also. Okay, listen. I like that Proto's ribcage is showing. I don't understand. Stop yawning. Because these are fun it. and really great. They're fine. They're just like... You know what's fine, Heather? What? What's fine is when you're in high school and your parents buy you a car that's very cheap because they want you to have your very first vehicle that you can drive back and forth to school so they don't have to drive you and so you don't look like an a on the bus. Okay? You get a little too old for the bus. You don't want to be 18 years old on that bus. That's all I'm saying. What's fine is the car they give you. Whatever that dumb piece of car is that you drive back and forth in that's fine you don't walk out and be like oh my god this is the greatest thing that's ever happened to me but wouldn't it be better if it's a brand new mustang or a brand new corvette that you oh my god this is so awesome but when you walk out and you see that little rusty dumper first thing comes to mind this is fine you walk into arby's their food i don't it's just fine no it's not fine it's gross okay you get a domino's pizza it's fine mm, gross you go see the newest saw film fine i haven't seen it so i can't say anything about it anything that the mcu puts out anymore fine more like great but with a set like this awesome this is fantastic i love it i think this is an epic set is one of the coolest ones they're putting glow in the dark funko pops in the lineup that is the special nft touch boop hey hey hey, hey 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 no hey, i really don't like that i need to boop you i did the boop already so i'm not doing okay. it. i'm just gonna touch it now no, it's okay boop me i'll poop you get it because i'm gonna all over you later so is there any other information out about this i mean we've seen photos and stuff but i don't see any info okay so basically all it says is available on october the 31st at 11 a.m pt which is cool that's actually happening on halloween i'm going to be all over it this set will sell incredibly fast this is one of those things that people don't just sit on, like Back to the Future or Jurassic Park or any of the others or WB 100th anniversary. They're gonna jump directly on this Funko Ween series because it's a great series and it's very creative. It's not just some dumb license and they're just putting out Funko Pops again. This is something that's very fun, interesting, and awesome. It is very awesome, it is very interesting, but again, as of right now- Proto's not... brain is showing, Heather. Yeah, I, I'm cool with Proto. God, you're being so stupid about this. I'm I don't not. Even no, I was I was looking for details on the drop, but I can't find any. It basically says, "Join us on social to be notified when details are available." Because there aren't. Can you stop? I'm still very bored. There aren't any details yet because they're hanging in front of us like a carrot. You know, with a horse like in a carrot, I don't and they're really just like leading us around until they finally drop all the information Listen, that we need to know. If you're interested in getting me excited about something, make it like a boba or a cheesecake or a cheese steak or lasagna or stir fry. Mm, I love stir fry. Do you like any of these? I really love the pirate, and the more I see Proto, the more that I like him. But the pirate, love him. The samurai's badass. I love his glow in the dark sword. So, and I love the knight also. Listen, like I said, it reminds me, me of Kurgan from Highlander, That's which cool. I love. Let me tell you fantastic. something. I don't want anyone to misunderstand me. I think that these are very cool, but they're just like they just don't resonate with me. Oh my god. You don't resonate with me right now. Because okay. these Listen, are the I'm married. I, I, I just can't even believe and you've that never you would come in here. You would come in Ever. here and you would say these things. It makes no sense. They, these are amazing, and you should be yelling and screaming just like me. How excited you no. are! But you're you're acting. I saw you more excited for the Jurassic Park drop. That's stupid. You're stupid. That's why you like Harry Potter. Why? I get it now. Because it's Jurassic all coming together. Park? I don't know. I don't even like no. Jurassic Park. Harry Potter. I already told you Harry Potter was made for dumb people. And the fact that you're more excited for Jurassic Park than this Halloween. Funko I, I said I wasn't it excited for Jurassic Park. That you or not. Except the mosquito. I liked the you're mosquito. Kind of a stupid person. I like the mosquito like I like the pirate. Like that is a very cool pop, and so is the pirate. Okay. It's fine. I, I don't care if you like it or not. By the way, this is our thousand dollar drop. It's gonna get crazy. We're gonna have like 15 samurais. <laughs>
You'd be so mad. I will be very mad there's about the samurai. So many, there's going to be so many I'll samurai. I'll be really mad about. How about how about sixteen pirates? You got more, more than samurai. Feel good about that? Then uh, stepping on a treasure chest, that do, pirate. But why do we need more than one? You're telling me you don't want to Scrooge McDuck it and just swim in our new Funko Ween Freddy Funko Pops and Proto the dog? It's now so you weird. just sound stupid. It's sort of weird. It isn't weird. It's sort you know of creepy. What's, you know what's weird and creepy? What you? No. The fact that you haven't hit the subscribe button or the like button, but nor did, nor have you did. hit the bell. And the bell tells you anytime we go live or post new content, and you don't want to miss any of that because Heather and I's banter, Heather disliking Funko Ween Funko Pops. I mean, don't you want to see me I get very upset them. and worked up about that? Don't you want to see that? Don't you want to see Heather very excited about Harry Potter related things when it was made for dumb people? She's so dumb, she just figured this out tonight. I had to spoon feed it to her. Now that's dumb. Also, check out our Patreon at patreon.com slash castlecast. Yeah, we do a lot of cool shit over there. Don't miss that, because we have a brand new live Zoom meeting next Saturday, October the 28th at 9 p.m. Eastern, and we're going to be giving away all sorts of stuff and also showing some mystery mischief toys stuff we like to drop a couple of secrets in there it's very fun okay so we talked about all the nft fun let's unbox our brand new freddy funko halloween nft pops what do you think of that it'll probably be a lot less boring than the other side oh they're fantastic you're so silly are you serious yeah. funko ween that set and you. I am five seconds away from breaking them glasses and throwing them to a garbage disposal. Do it. I don't want to see your ugly face. All right, so we got a little bit of damage right here and a little bit of damage on top, but I think we're going to be okay. I don't have any concerns. Hey, 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 hey. Man, what the f You couldn't have done that without me. Because you're stupid. <laughs> it was like Freddy Krueger would come up in here. Oh, there's so much fire. Wow, these look so great in person. So I don't understand why these don't like fall under the Funko Ween stuff? Like what makes these different? Do you, do you even understand it? I think they're trying to piss you off or confuse you. That is really weird. This one's my favorite. Oh my God, that one's badass. The Reaper? Yes. The I Reaper's cool. It. it has a really cool like base to it. That might be one of the coolest Freddy Funkos ever made. Look at him pointing too. So the only one of this lineup we did not get was the Phantom of the Opera Freddy. I didn't care so much for it. So here is a translucent, invisible Freddy Funko. Invisible man Freddy Funko. Isn't it cool? cool? So I did not like this pop that I'm holding right now, this space zombie. This is my favorite one. Uh, he's awesome. Yeah, he is. This is my favorite one of this set. This is the zombie. This is my Freddy favorite, Funko. the Reaper. Look at this guy. And look at the Reaper. He's so cool. They have like these little creatures and stuff attached to it. And look, Reaper has skulls and he also... It's like smoke or something, right? It's a fart cloud. Did you notice this? It has like a shininess to the helmet and to his crown. Yeah, I just farted. Look, it's a jack-o'-lantern, Freddy. He's holding a lollipop and a jack-o'-lantern bag. And he has an orange bow tie. And his crown's made of wood. I don't think it's wood. I think it's the top of the pumpkin. Oh my God. Holy <laughs> shit. I did not expect that. Oh I don't my know. God. That might be my This is favorite. Krampus Freddy and there are arms coming up out of the ground. Jeez, that is so badass looking. These are insane. Good Lord, Funko. What were you guys thinking making all this? They're thinking that Killing they're gonna it. wow us. I honest to God thought that this was like Satan originally. When they first showed the photo, I didn't realize this was Krampus. To me personally, this does not say Krampus at all. He's missing the child on his back. He is, but it looks like a demon to me. It looks like a demon. Right? Yeah. It doesn't look like Krampus to me. Even I mean, his isn't face Krampus and everything. sort of a demon though? He is, but Krampus, I imagine him almost like dressed as Santa Claus with like a bag, yeah. kind of like Santa, but I don't know. I know there's a lot of different variations of Krampus, so I guess this would fit, but it looks like the devil to me. These are the coolest Funko Pops possibly ever, this set. Up until the new Funko Ween set that comes out, because that's gonna be killer. Actually, really though, I really like these a lot. I think these might be better than the newer set, 
but I love some of the newer set. The Reaper is just like so good. And the Krampus. The Invisible Man, I didn't really care about this one, but seeing him in person, I He's really cool. I really like him. This whole Halloween series might be over. This might be the end of this series, and now they're only going to do Funko Ween, which the Funko Ween set, as I mentioned before, is killer. I am totally stoked for that set. I cannot wait to see that one in person. I will be going balls to the wall trying to get those Funko Pops. Okay, serious question. What does balls to the wall mean? You're literally putting your balls on that wall. Is it like Lil John's from the window to the wall to the sweat drips down your balls? No, I don't think so. I think that, hold on, hold on, hold on. According to English Stack Exchange, first attested in the 1960s in the context of aviation, probably coined by pilots whose throttle levers had round, ball-like tops and for whom putting the balls to the wall meant making the aircraft fly as quickly as possible. Wow, okay, that's pretty cool. So they're taking the little controllers and they push as hard as they can and they're pushing those balls, because that's what's on the little levers, to the wall. They're pushing them up like this. That was a lot more boring than I thought. I mean, I'm glad to know that. Maybe we can like go to trivia night or something and use it. Well, thanks, Heather. I really appreciate all of your support. So guys, what do you think about this epic set? What do you think about the Funko Ween set? I'm really stoked over this one. I'm really stoked over the new one. I will be going hard on October 31st to get the whole Funko Ween set. I'm, I want it all. I want it all. I want it all. And I want it now. Is that a real song? I don't know. I just sounded real. <laughs> <laughs> I have no clue what I just did. I feel like I just had an outer body experience. This is truly a Halloween episode. Thank you guys so much for staying until the very end of the video. We really appreciate all of your support. It means the world to us. In this video, we'd like to shout out to some of our patrons from Patreon because they're so awesome. In this video, we'd like to shout out to Michael Nitzkabich, Stacey Lehman, Randy Johnson, Matt Klein, Trudy Scarborough Farlow, AJ Barbary, Michael Ramsden, Jennifer Crawford, Imani McKinney, and Tiffany Anderson. Thank you guys so much for your continued support. We appreciate all of our patrons. You guys rock. And don't forget, make sure to hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and also hit the little bell. That way you'll know anytime we go live or post brand new content. We really appreciate all of your support. It means the world to us. It helps this channel to continue to grow.